Hello, 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 my love bug. Once again, it's your girl Lumi Love here with another message from the divine. As I always say today, if you're hearing my voice, I ask that you harden not your heart, for I am just a messenger and we are all here to witness and learn. Thank you guys for your likes, subscribe, shares, views, and memberships. Everything is greatly appreciated, my loves. So let's go ahead and get into it. Okay, we'll be doing a good energy read um on this. What is this? This is Wednesday on this good Wednesday. Yeah, we're gonna do our energy reading, the energy of cancer. Okay, so this is open to the collective. The only thing that I have just for my cancers are gonna be these lucky numbers. And after we get these lucky numbers, we'll read in the energy of cancer for the entire collective. Okay, so let's see what numbers we got and we get on into it. Oh my, oh hell no, hell. oh hell no, oh ah. <laughs> I'm going to read these numbers and I ain't reading them twice. I ain't going to take nothing from you. But this is a list. Him. Don't y'all cancels ask me for no more lucky numbers for about two weeks. All right, y'all. Okay, lucky numbers are 39, 24, 21. Forty-seven and thirty-five. Play that back, baby, because I'm not. All right, let's keep it moving. See what we got for the collective and the energy of Cancer. See what could possibly be going on. You know, with some love songs playing in my head, but DJ, won't you play this girl a love song? She really need to hear this freaking love song. But not done my whole world. <laughs> All she need is me like me to be the be the be the be I can see that you want me, baby. All right, somebody want to get some of you. Don't you man gonna approach you, baby? I can see curiosity. Okay, somebody said they can see that you need to be pleased. Somebody won't please you. I don't know, child. They want you to play a love song. Open up this motherfucker heart chakra so I can get in there. <laughs> Y'all, this is somebody who need to quit it. You don't want this person in your energy at all, but this person wants to send you some sort of energy, some love energy, some love songs, send something, some, some something I'm hearing about love to your brain frequency, get you in the mood and then slide right on in. Okay, this person thought they was going to be able to do it, but they can. They thought shit was sweet. Baby, your guard is up. You're not playing with this individual. This is no one you want to play with, okay? This person is a drinker. If you don't know who this is, this is the person who's a heavy drinker who's obviously obsessed over you every time they turn that bottle up. It's like when they're not drunk, they can ignore the fact that they're obsessing over you. But when they're drunk, baby, that's when they feel like they got the power, they got the courage, and they can try. Too much, okay? Ooh, I heard this person said they get on demon time. If they can get a hold of you. This person really wants to manipulate you. They don't like the fact that you're in this divine feminine energy and they want to knock you off your high horse, your pedestal, whatever, okay? But this is destined for you. This is destined for you, okay? Yeah, this person thought they were going to be able to set you up real easily and manipulate you, have control over you, some sort of domination work so that they can get a spiritual level up. <clears throat> they wanted to control you, have you like a doll. Because you're the one with spiritual gifts. You're in a high vibration. What's this? Yes. So money. So you're in a high vibration. You're guaranteed to get to the bag. You're in a, you're in a real boss uh, woman energy hustler. Okay. So this person could possibly have been a masculine from your past. That's very jealous of your come up. <clears throat> this person is jealous that you're getting money. This person is jealous that you're getting, you know, you have a uh, clientele you got a group of people watching you maybe you got a group of people shopping with you this person can't stand the fact that every time they tried to block you maybe in a community from getting money that you will find another way to get money this person is figuring out that is he he put too much dip on his chip all right he thought he could just overpower you and he spent a lot of energy trying to do so and ain't getting nowhere this person is a follower okay this person wanted to follow you into your divine energy because this person said shit, all the magic I did, and I ain't knocked this motherfucker off. This motherfucker must be special. Let me go be nice. Ain't this something? 
Let me go be nice. This person tried to attack you spiritually multiple times. Jinx your hex, you curse your kill. Yeah, this person didn't care. This person was very upset that you wouldn't let them control you by giving them no cootie mama. See, this person wanted to try to get in this energy where they felt like they wanted to get in a very masculine energy. Pretend to be very masculine just to get in your draw so that they can take your energy. You probably got more masculine energy than this person do, okay? All they wanted to do was have sex with you. They might have even wanted to record it so they can expose these hidden truths. Maybe they wanted to sell this recording, okay? Because it's talking about thought shit was sweet. Hidden truths coming out about how they got money, okay? This person's upset. Whatever evil lie they were sending towards you, like I said, jealousy and all that shit to stop you with all these other people they could have been trying to set you up with, it did not work. This person get drunk and he don't want nobody but you, okay? He know you don't sell cootie because if you sold it, he would buy it. This person is just so upset. They all discombobulated and trapped and caught up in their feelings because they told so much bullshit about you to everybody they don't even know where they stand at crazy now this person is all in their feelings trying to send you some sort of energy to get in your drawers and child you divinely protected you ain't heard a nail song you ain't heard a nail song until i was trying to sing it okay this person could have also been working with some sort of copycat energy that wanted to be you it's like this this like this man could have possibly tried to keep you in a third party and if he had a female at home he wanted that female to be you so he was willing to try to trick you to take your energy to bring it back to his and i'm hearing what i'm, I'm gonna just say what the, the spirits say take that energy to bring it back to his bitch okay Okay, whoever this is, let me know this story right here. The reason they said bitch like that is because this is somebody who you cut off. Somebody you ain't got no mercy for. Somebody you don't care for. All right, you knew this person never really liked you like that. You cut this person off because they showed to be an op. They showed to be a foe. And this person tried to partner up with this masculine in order to take this from you. Okay, but you're a healer. That's why you chilling. Whatever they throw at you, that shit... That shit don't do nothing. You wash it clean off, okay? You wash it and pray it off. Whatever they try to do, it's not working. You know both of these people are in this karmic energy. Okay, it's a fuck boy, fuck girl. Both of them want revenge because you a hustler. Both of them tried to stop you and they can't. Two rats trying to get a piece of your piece of pie, child. Pretending like they genuinely care for you in the past while they probably were sleeping and hunking all behind your back, child. Now they together in a relationship and they need some help. They need some milk. <laughs> I'm just say they need some milk. Yeah, because you took back your energy. All right, these people literally are toxic as hell, and they were feeding off the fact they were feed. They were celebrating too early. These people thought that they were feeding off of your energy, but they were wasting their time. These people really thought that being together, sleeping behind your back, and doing things behind your back, uh, was really hurting your feelings, and they were trying to siphon some sort of energy from you. But you was chilling. You was chilling. You in a high vibration. You already knew that neither one of these people need deserve to be around you. That's why you cut their ass off. Okay, these people might have, like I said, tried to do some domination work. Now they feel dominated. Okay, one of them got a straight up mental illness and it's probably this feminine. She can't stand the fact that she eat. Okay, she can't stand the fact that she worked so hard to trick you. I don't know how long this broad knew you, but this broad felt like she wanted to trick your ass from day one. She couldn't stand you. She wanted everything that you had. So when she finally got a chance to suck on your man, she took that chance to do so. And she was loving the fact that they were sleeping together behind your back. Oh, she loved it, child. She thought it was the best thing since sliced bread. I don't even really think she liked this man like that. But the fact that this this man had feelings for you at some point the fact that you probably slept with this man at some point she made it her goal to do so because she just knew when you found out you was gonna be mad oh yeah and he just thought he was the man he said damn all her homegirls or her family or whatever they want a piece of me too so i'm gonna just go and get him some she must be telling them i'm the shit she must be telling them i'm this and i'm that child this man really thought he was all of that and you were going around bragging on him so he had to put on the show for this feminine both of these karmic fools rolling around in somebody else's sheets thinking they pissing you off. Meanwhile, you collecting your energy, getting ready to step over into a whole new cycle the Holy Spirit got for you. That's why she mentally ill. That's why she fucked up because she can't even get it right. She, feel, she already is. She has low self-esteem and she's insecure and she feel like she can't get it right in life. But the only reason she feel like she can't get it right is because she can't be you. So yeah, she fucked up, square one. And then for two, she really thought she had you where she wanted you. She really thought she had you in the right position. Both of them did. Thought they had you in the right position just to have you upset. Because this masculine was ups this masculine was jealous of you as well. Okay? Y'all know how it is when you get in a relationship with somebody, they lack and, and, and they're jealous of you. This masculine was jealous of your hustle. This is somebody who was with you that was jealous of your hustle. Like nine out of ten. I'm getting you're very generous. So if you ate, your people eat. These two was your people. And they was eating. 
Huh? And thought it was okay to bite the hand that was feeding their raggedy butts. Child, now you out here celebrating. You don't need them, okay? You, you're, 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 you're celebrating maybe in a group of people that actually care about you now, okay? You're going to have a soul tribe of people. You got people that trust you, want to care for you, that'll gather around you and protect you versus stand behind your back and grimace. All right? You're enchanting to anyone who gets into your energy. You can't help it. Everybody want to partner up with you and work with you because you got real good energy. All right? Let me um see where this other card went, y'all. Give me a second here. Bitch, about to pick it up. All right. <clears throat> Whew, yeah, I'm telling you, you might have a damn. You might have like a like I said, you might have a collective of people that shop with you now. It's like whatever you do now, these people caught wind of it. It could be online. Uh, you can have an online shop, online platform, whatever. But these people caught wind of that shit, and it just, it just, it really hit home for them. And I'm hearing literally, it really hit home. These people wanted you homeless. Now they homeless. <laughs> they might be sleeping with whoever they was cheap. Damn. Okay, so they was with each other. These some whores here. They was with each other. And now that the house that they had together is no longer a home, they had to go sleep with whoever they was cheating with on the side when they was together. You know what I'm saying? Like, one of them might be at another side bitch house. The masculine might be at one of his side bitches' houses, and then this feminine might have had to go shack up with another man or go back with her old baby daddy or some shit. <laughs> yeah, she had a breaking point, and she had to go back with her baby daddy and leave this person she was cheating with, and he had to go back and go back to whatever feminine he was with. All right, anyway, they, they like to trick. They like to sleep around anyway. That's what they want to do. All right, you have a brand new cycle, and you're going to be receiving justice. Yes, karmic justice. Everything is going in your favor. You're having a rebirth. You might even be having a new baby child. Either way, it goes. Success is in your future, and you got the whole world in your hands. And they shocked about it, child. All right, y'all. This is it. This is all my loves. I hope you got what you needed from this reading. I'm going to go ahead and clear this mess off, and we will get into another. So meet me in the next one. Uh -huh.